Now to an issue that local lawmakers are still trying to find an answer to. How to keep the Broadway market a happening place all year round. Take a look. This is the scene today. Quiet, almost like a ghost town. But just a week ago today, a totally different experience. This is video from Good Friday when it was elbow to elbow all day with people getting ready for Easter, the busiest time for the market. Now lawmakers are trying to find a way to keep the crowds coming. 7 Eyewitness News is everywhere. Sierra Johnson is live outside the market tonight. Sierra? It's almost like a different place. Take a look behind me. There's not many people at the Broadway market. That's because many of their customers come during Easter. Now several customers and vendors are hoping that changes. Now the Broadway market has been a mainstay in this community since the 1800s. Over time, the population has changed and everyday trips became annual trips to the market during the Easter holiday. But Councilman Dave Franzak says the city is dedicated to re-energizing the market and a new project will hopefully do just that. The city is going to put in a commercial kitchen, which can be used as an educational tool uh, for people, you know, to learn new skills, uh, how to prepare food, how to maybe start in a new career. And Frontex says the new commercial kitchen will hopefully jumpstart entrepreneurship in the growing area. And another move the city leader hopes will re-energize this area, a new floor. We've all grown to love those green floors, and by this summer, those floors will be replaced. Frontex says that could be the first of many more projects to come. Reporting live here at the Broadway Market, Sierra Johnson, 7 Eyewitness News.